Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to WrestleMania, and we are here with our second to last match of the show, and it's going to be a good one. We've got Ben Balor taking on the leader of the Wyatt family, Bray Wyatt. This is going to be huge. Action, ladies and gentlemen. Fourth man about to enter the Royal Rumble. It's Bray Wyatt from behind. Sister Abigail. Mess with him. Choke slam. Bam! About to enter this match. They're waiting on the person. Who is it? Oh man. It's Finn Balor. Nice headlock there, but oh, Bray Wyatt. Oh no! Oh, it's eliminated. Bray, Bray Wyatt is now eliminated. And that, no! Oh man, that is cheap. Ourselves. What in the world was? Oh, what? we hide behind these costumes. And here comes the Demon King himself. There it is, the corner drop kick. He's bought it. Kota Gra could be knocked out cold. What? What? He's finisher the double under power bomb. And that's it. One, two, three. Molenko advances. Of me. To me, that you're not afraid. Very intense there, ladies and gentlemen, and here we go with this match. It's set to be a huge one, ladies and gentlemen, and here comes the Eater of Worlds, the sadistic, the twisted Bray Wyatt. But oh man, here is his opponent. The He's just, just, I'm speechless at how amazing of an athlete Finn Balor is and this is going to be huge Finn Balor Bray Wyatt one on one face to face here we go Wrestlemania and here comes Balor off the ropes but no Uranaki Balor just got planted by Wyatt with a huge Uranaki just right off the bat and here comes Wyatt sent over the top rope by Balor Balor looking to take advantage, flying out cross body, no, caught in midair, and oh, oh, twice, slammed twice against that pole, and Wyatt charges at him, and oh, Finn Balor moves out of the way, on the apron, oh, dropping the legs, dropping both boots into the back of his head, now here comes Balor taking advantage. No, DDT, no, ducks a clothesline. Off the ropes, crossbody, caught, slam, no. Here comes Sling Blade. A huge Sling Blade there by Finn Balor into the cover. He could have it here, but no. Bray Wyatt manages to kick out. And oh, a kick across the chest. Springboard splash by Finn Balor taking full advantage. Oh my god. What in the world? That is creepy. Coup de gras. A standing coup de gras. That is as interesting as it gets. And he's going to do the real thing. Top rope. He could hit it. Here we go. No. Smart move by Bray Wyatt. Managing to roll out of the way. But here comes Bray. No. Bray. Got him. Sister Abigail. That's Sister Abigail. That's it. Here's the cover. And oh my. Oh my god. He kicked out. Bray Wyatt is frustrated, and he's, t oh, oh my god, he's exposed, the turnbuckle sends him into a no, Bray, oh, Balor moves out of the way, and Bray face first into that turnbuckle, and now, dropkick into the corner, oh, man, Bray Wyatt's on the apron though, very smart place to be, but wait, what, Cody, grr, on the apron, coat of ground on the apron. That has got to be it. That is it, 100%. But what? what is Balor doing? Finish the match. Finn, finish the match. He's let Bray up to his feet. Wh uh, what? 
What in the world is going on? Sister Abigail into the cover. Two, three. What, what have we just witnessed here, ladies and gentlemen? Finn Balor has sacrificed himself to the devil. And I am just... Oh my god. I am in complete shock here, ladies and gentlemen. Finn Balor has sacrificed himself. But tomorrow, the next part, Neville and Cesaro, one-on-one SNA championship. That's not the only match. We've got The Rock taking on the mystery figure. And whoever wins that will have control of SNA. Stay tuned, ladies and gentlemen.